Good morning and welcome to Dogman Homestead. Today we are back on the build. Uh, didn't do anything to it yesterday, but I did come out here several times figuring things out. As you can see behind me, I took that one two by six out. It didn't serve any purpose. It was going to make life difficult for me for doing the roof. And uh, it will go back on, but it will be straight across that will also help me when when i do my framing it'll look much better got that one off as well and we're going to start putting the joist up the rafters up for the roof and it worked out perfectly so hopefully the only notch i have will be right there i don't even think i'll need one we'll, we'll just have to see all right guys i'm gonna get busy I have been spending the morning fixing things. Haven't got a whole lot accomplished. I'm going to tell you what happened. I went to put the rafters on the roof. And, you know, they should be running exactly with uh, the deck uh, joists. You know, they may not be right exactly underneath them, but they weren't. Then I got to thinking, well, I put a 2 by 6 on that pole. So that's out an inch and a half. So I fixed that right there and then i got to look at them like there's still something wrong well here at this end on the deck joist <laughs> that one's at 21 inches instead of 16 on center and but down here it's 16 on center all the way down so what had happened is this pole here isn't square with the other one so i've already unbolted that all i gotta do to fix this thank god i found this is bang this down the 16 on center and then i'll put a uh, a board in between there to shim it out uh, but i found it but it's eating up a lot of my day so once i get that fixed i get get on with the roof so hopefully we'll have some something uh interesting to show you today all right guys all right i got that joist move over where it needs to be the problem was when i set this pole my string line was off. Uh, that's the only thing I can come up with. It's off an inch, inch and a half. <laughs> I don't know, I don't remember which end I started putting these joists on, I think down here, but I can't believe I didn't catch that when I put the block in because the block was a whole lot bigger. So now we are totally squared up and we're getting ready to start on the roof. Uh, you know, when you're building a project like this, guess what? You're going to make mistakes. You will make them. But the nice thing about carpentry, turn your ram, is when you make a mistake, especially if it's something where you missed a measurement or it's off square, you're going to find it before you finish the project, most likely, because something's just not going to line up. And, and you, you will find it, like I found that, and I didn't find that until I was putting the roof joists on, and the roof joists were going like this and those were going straight and i knew it wasn't right uh so i got i just started looking at everything you know sometimes you gotta look at it <laughs> look at it look at this look at that and i found it so now we can move on i would have much rather discovered this mistake now than when we started putting the deck boards on and that one would be five inches away so now everything is perfectly square that pole I'll leave there. I'll put a board in between it, like that one. It'll it'll match up. So maybe that was that was probably the issue. Any no, it wasn't because that's supporting it. I don't know. All right, let's get All busy. All right, let's put a rafter up. Got everything fixed. That took a long time. Boy, I had things screwed up, but we're going for it. All right. I got so many marks on there. And this one is obviously not the one I cut for it. I had to take these down. All right, let me see here. Get a screw ready. Should already be a screw in it. Yep. All right, let's get it on center. Our chair. Missed it. I remember now. Not easy. 
Uh, there it is, there's my line. Uh. All right. Oh, that's much better. I think. Beating me to death today. That's a little off. No, it ain't. I just need to twist it. There we are. And it's not going to be exact with that. All right. Now I got to cut a joist hanger. Let's see. I'll bring you back for that. Cut these down to fit two by fours. I got a whole box of them, 50. I don't need 50. Might as well use them. All right. There's the center. Get it on center. Get on. this side and then we can take the clamp off. Hey Wally, you want to go down to the soda fountain with me? Oh gee Eddie, I can't on account I gotta babysit the beef. Ah, oh, gee, bring the little squirt with ya. Man, were those shows corny. But we all watched the Beeb. That Beeb, you never know what he was gonna do next. We are off on the rafters. Hopefully, no more mistakes. That is why I like to wear pocket tees. I don't like tool belts. I put it on for a while. I couldn't stand it. Good. All right. On to the next one. It's already cut. I used to love sneezes. They hurt now. Alright, where's the other floor? Right here. You hear that bird? That's the Tweedledurk bird. You know? Twit alert. Twit alert. Move you guys back for this. Alright. Get one more after this one. And then we'll throw a piece of tin up there. And I am going to put a front porch on the sidewalk in. You'll see later. Alright, let me get my drill ready for over there. Twit alert. Wait alert. Wait alert. Wait alert. Wait alert. See, he's talking to me. He thinks I'm a Tweedle Dirk. I am a Tweedle Dirk. Alright, we got you there. Get a screw in my mouth. Oh, 
Tweedledurk bird's got a friend. Alright, I was going to see, what I was going to do was do three, put a piece of tin on. But I need to check and see if I can get up in through there, then I can just string them all. Whoa, look at there. Must be that Jimmy Craig died I'm on. Man, I can get up in there and do all kinds of good stuff. Alright, we'll string them off. It's going pretty quick too. What I got? One, two, three, four, five, seven, eight, nine more to go. Then we get the Chiba 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 bird out. I didn't have these birds when I bought this place. I put feeders out all winter and they stay. They have their babies here. I had I had a lot more bird houses out. Chiba, Chiba, Chiba. We got the morning doves. Can't do it today. See if I can get one to answer me. Ah, get to work. All right, I'm going to stop right here, go eat me a sandwich, come back out and knock the rest of these out. I want the metal on this today, and I'm going to work until it happens. Uh, we ain't got to worry about covering everything up. I can remove stuff in here. Cool. Shouldn't be a problem. All right, guys, I'll be back. All right, we are ready to start throwing some metal on the roof. And I stopped here. I, ha I am going to have a whole 10. It's going to be a 10 foot high wall here for this other building. So I, I'm going to metal roof it to this point. Till, and then I'm going to frame this. Probably frame this wall out. Because I don't want to put anything there yet. Until I figure out what I'm going to do. Alright man. Let's get some metal going. And kind of looking like it might rain. But I don't care. If I get a roof over me I can still keep working right. And I just felt some drops so. I better get busy. What in the name of Telly Savalas is going on here? Oh, I gotta move all this before I can get to the metal. Uh.
Ten. Ooh, I hate it. It's gotta be cut. Thought I ordered ten sheets, ten foot sheets, it's twelve foot sheets. Uh, let's see. one up I gotta clear some room all right first piece going up now I don't know where to put you guys, man. All right. We're all the way over here. We are. Okay, I'm gonna have to do some notching, but I need it straight. And that's where it needs straight. All right. I kind of like that white. Oop, I got it around, slam. Definitely gonna need flashing. Why is that not square? Get you on something. Now I'm going to put a roof here coming out this way so it really don't matter here. I'm going to be catching the rain coming off that way. That's why I took those out so I didn't have to notch it and go all through but uh, we'll see how it fits. All right guys let me get all right unfortunately I'm going to have to stop right here before I go any further with the roof I'm going to have to go buy some flashing there's I knew I, I knew I wasn't going to get away without putting it on there, which it needs anyway. Flashing will deflect any of the water. See the crack up there? Now, this is just slid up there, but it needs flashing because water will seep right through there. And I'm going to do it right. So I'm going to go get some, I don't know, two or three inch flashing and put that on tomorrow. And this roof should not take very long at all to put on. So. I mean, I can already feel the difference in the shade right underneath it. So we will get that done tomorrow. And guys, if you have not subscribed to my channel, uh, go ahead and I'd appreciate it if you'd subscribe. I'm trying to find where the sun is. <laughs> uh, give me a like, give me an unlike. I don't care. Uh, I'm trying to get this thing knocked out, but little things happen and you gotta stop and fix them. And I'm not gonna go any further and I'm also going to get, uh, they got little inserts you put in here where the bugs can't get in. That's a must have. If you're gonna, I mean, no sense in having a screened in porch if they can get in that way. So I'll be getting some of those. I'll probably order them. You can put them in anytime. So I'm going to end this video here. It was getting a little long anyway. Uh, I appreciate you guys. 
Happy trails. Well, I got a guest today. Oh, yeah, from Bobblehead Homestead. Yeah. Thought I'd stop by. He's got a friend. This is the only way we can have peace and quiet is Jeff has to sit here and pet Libby. Look at her. So what do you have the attention? What do you yeah, think of the do. What do you think of the build? Uh, it's looking great. Yeah. yeah we're testing out my new chairs for the patio. Yeah, these are good too. I thought there were four chairs and a table, but there was no table. And then I looked at my Amazon. Sure enough, it was four chairs, but that's all right. I'll, I'll build a table. Yeah, you can build a table. If you can build a, an add-on room and a deck, you can definitely build a table. Yeah, that looks good. You're getting ready to do the roofing. I got one sheet up, but I got to get flashing. I can't I, get, I can't continue without flashing, but yeah. a few days we'll be able to sit up top. And I showed up just to quit in time. Yep. They don't call me an idiot often. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. Just thought I'd throw in another clip since Jeff showed up. Look at this dog. Is he your friend? Yeah. Maybe. Yeah, you that's got a good friend. stuff. Boy, your ears have gotten real good now. That medicine they gave her last time worked real good. All right, guys. If you haven't uh, checked out Jeff's channel, check him out. I'll leave a link at the bottom. Bobblehead Homestead. Uh, he does chickens. And eggs. And he's got cats. And he's got raccoons. And today I got a bunch of flowers. Yeah, we got, got flowers. All right, guys.